le pays au chaos. Ce jour, 30 août 2023, nous, forces de défense et de sécurité, réunis au sein du comité pour la transition et la restauration des institutions CTRI, au nom du peuple gabonais et garant de la protection des institutions, avons décidé de défendre la paix en mettant fin au régime en place. À cet effet, les élections générales du 26 août 2023 ainsi que les résultats tronqués sont annulés. Les frontières sont fermées jusqu'à nouvel ordre. Toutes les institutions de la République sont dissoutes, notamment le gouvernement, le Sénat, l'Assemblée nationale, la Cour constitutionnelle, le Conseil économique, social et environnemental, le Conseil gabonais des élections. Nous appelons la population, les communautés des pays, des pays frères, installés au Gabon, ainsi que les Gabonais de la diaspora, au calme et à la sérénité. Nous réaffirmons notre attachement au respect des engagements du Gabon vis-à-vis -vis de la communauté nationale. Et... Gabon Militaire says the power in a coup d'état. A group of senior Gabonese military officers appeared on national television in the early hours of Wednesday and said they had taken power after the state election body announced President Ali Bongo had won a third term. Appearing on television channel Gabon 24, the officers said they represented all security and defense forces in the Central African nation. They said the election results were cancelled or borders closed until further notice and state institutions dissolved. Loud sounds of gunfire could be heard in the capital Libreville, a Lauda's report said after the television appearances. There was no immediate comment from the government of the APEC member nation. In the name of the Gabonese people, we have decided to defend the peace by putting an end to the current regime, the officers said. Tensions were running high amid fears of unrest after Saturday's presidential parliamentary and legislative vote, which saw Bongo seeking to extend his family's 56-year grip on power while the opposition pushed for change in the oil and cocoa rich but poverty-stricken nation. A lack of international observers, the suspension of some foreign broadcasts and the authorities' decision to cut internet service and impose a night curfew nationwide after the poll had raised concerns about the transparency of the electoral process. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe and also turn on the bell icon to receive notifications every time we upload new videos. Peace.